That was pretty nice. Um, really bad vocals, depending on what you're into. I like vocals like that personally. I think it adds a lot more soul to it when it's just like someone who's singing. He's not necessarily great at it, um, but he's still doing it. He's doing it with as much soul as he can fucking muster. I like it. That was Baby Blue by King Cruel off of his 2013 album Six Feet Beneath the Moon. We're listening to that today because we have a Juliana Barwick song from 2013 up in competition today. Hi, my name is Bean, and you're watching Battle of the Band. We're on day 26 of the Juliana Barwick tournament today, and that is match 17 in round 2. So we're in the first match of the second half of round 2 now. And we have a song that had to fight through the first round and did not get a bye. It had to battle a 10 minute epic in order to get here today. If you're new here and you're wondering what a Juliana Barwick tournament is, let me fill you in. We took every single song that Juliana Barwick has released so far, and we threw them into a single elimination style tournament. And now they're doing battle and head to head competition until one remains in the end, and that's the very best song Juliana Barwick has released so far. Today we have a song from her debut LP versus a song from her sophomore lp first up we'll be listening to a bob in your gate which was released on a magic place in 2011 her debut lp and that'll be going up against crystal lake which was released in 2013 on her sophomore lp nepenthe crystal lake did go against rain and shine at the lotus pond in the first round but we're here to listen to these songs and see which one's the better of the two so let's go ahead and get into it first up we have Bob in your gate.
That was great. I really like that. Um, super chill, awesome pianos, cool vocals. Overall, good vibes. Really liked it. Uh, let's see how Crystal Lake compares. Of that electronic noise fade out uh, the bleeps and bloops atmospherics of the whole thing is really nice i kind of like the glitchy aspect you get from it um typically i don't love vocals that sound like that but here they work really great just to kind of ebb and flow in the song 
I'm gonna go with Crystal Lake. That one's really good. Um, just super like a little bit noisy enough for me. It's got some glitch in there, um, and just really kind of a, just a chill vibe that I really enjoyed. Uh, Bob in Your Gate though is really good too, and that's nothing to scoff at. Uh, Bob in Your Gate deserved better than to die in the second round in this tournament. We've got social media if you want to talk about it. We've got Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. There's also a TikTok account if you feel like these videos are a bit too long and you wish they were shortened down. Except these ones, probably. Um, check out that TikTok account. I'll link the songs as well as the tournament bracket down in the description of the video, so make sure you check that out. But if you look down below me here, you'll see the tournament bracket URL has appeared, and you can type that into any web browser and check it out that way as well. We have a Venmo and a Cash app, and if you donate $10, you can get one of these No Ringo No Life buttons. Um, make sure you include an address with that donation to acquire one. Like this video if you like the video and subscribe if you haven't already. Share it with anyone you know who might be into this kind of chill ass music content and let me know what you think down in the comments. Which song you would have chosen if you were in the hot seat today. That's all the Juliana Barwick chill out we have for today, but please join me tomorrow when we do some more of all the songs. Hope you all have a great night, fantastic afternoon, and a wonderful morning. Bye. <laughs>